that is my answer to all of them. If I were to expand, I would say that's oh, it's ludicrous. An accused sex abuser denies he assaulted one of his students for years. The case against the former Franklin County school teacher now in the hands of the jury. Channel 3's Cam Smith has been in court all afternoon. He joins us live. Cam, what can you tell us? Yeah, Darren, the jury began their deliberations less than an hour ago in the case against Matthew Toof. The case dates back to 2021, where former sixth grade teacher Matthew Toof allegedly sexually assaulted the victim who was a student in his class several times starting when she was 11 years old. Toof faces aggravated sexual assault and lewd and lascivious conduct charges. Prosecutors allege the acts happened at school, at the victim's home, and on family vacations. Before handing the case over to the jury, both deputies State's attorney Diane Wheeler and Toof's attorney Robert Kaplan had one final chance to address the jury. Wheeler spoke to the severity of his alleged actions, and Kaplan told the jury that the allegations against Toof are false. There is not evidence at all beyond a reasonable doubt to believe that Matt Toof, the, the Barney Fife of infidelity, was able to engage in this secret five-year sexual abuse of this person. And it was sexual acts with that was his end desire, his scheme, and his plan. Now that bleep sound that you heard was the use of the victim's name in court. WCAX does not identify the victims of alleged abuse. Now this is still an active and ongoing night here at the courthouse. We will have continuing coverage for you as we get more updates. So stay with WCAX for those as they come. For now live in St. Albans, Cam Smith, Channel 3 News. Cam, thank you very much.